Hello everybody, this is Blake Cross EXE, and welcome back to the randomized neutral run of Undertale. We've reached Asgore's throne, and we're about to go fight Asgore himself. How oh, tense. Just think of it like a visit to the dentist. I really wish we could have kept the butterscotch pie all the way here. Are you ready? If you're not, I understand. Well, I'm not ready either. Save at the end. That has a trippy effect. This is the barrier. This is what keeps us all trapped underground. If, by any chance, you have any unfinished business, please do what you must. Let's do this, Asgore. This is it, then. Ready? Strange light fills the room. Twilight is shining through the barrier. Your journey is finally over. You are filled with determination. I'm going at I'm going at him with a gun this time instead of an instead of a book or a knife. So let's see how we do. It was nice to meet you. Goodbye. Alright, I gotta lower his defense first. Oh, dang, okay. Hey, uh, Asgore, what if I told you that I killed Toriel? Let, let's talk for a Nothing to say, alright? Oh, oh. Oh, oh, almost dodged it, okay. Nothing to say? Okay, I, I guess I, I can't talk him down. Can't talk him down, so I'm just gonna have to go out in full force. Okay, dodging, dodging. Yeah, we're good. All right. Okay, not not too hard. We're good. We're getting it. I uh, keep hitting the button too fast. Whoa! Big firestorm. Ouch. Ow. Okay. Ow. Almost. Oh. Oh. Ha. Halfway there. Gonna take next turn to drop a healing item. Ouch. Yeah, junk food. Here we go. Alright. Come on. Ouch. I keep hitting it either too soon or too late. Oh! Okay. Ouch. Ouch. Okay. Ouch. Ow. Ow. Dang it. Ah, hit hit one of those way off. Whoa. Aha! Okay. It's getting it's getting faster and harder to dodge. Running out of HP items. Okay. Got two criticals. Good.
Almost there. Got him. Whew. Okay. First try, too. Unlike last time where it took me like four or five tries. I don't remember how many it took. So this is how it is. I remember the day after my son died. The entire underground was devoid of hope. The future will once again be taken from, taken from us by the humans. In a fit of anger, I declared war. I said that it, I would destroy any human that came here. I would use their souls to become godlike and free us from this terrible prison. Then I would destroy humanity and let monsters rule the surface in peace. Soon, the people's hopes returned. My wife, however, became disgusted with my actions. She left this place never to be seen again. Truthfully, I do not want power. I do not want to hurt anyone. I just want everyone to have hope, but I cannot take this any longer. I just want to see my wife. I just want to see my child. Please, young one, this war's gone long enough. You have the power. Take my soul and leave this cursed place. All right, here we go. Asgore, what does the coin decide for your fate? I spare you, but Flowey doesn't. Ah, sorry, bud. After everything I've done to hurt you, you'd rather stay down here and suffer than live happily on the surface? Human, I promise you, for as long as you remain here, my wife and I will take care of you the best we can. But I killed your wife! We can sit on the living room telling stories, eating butterscotch pie. We could be like, like a family. And here comes Flowey. Like, first time playing this, I was so pissed when Flowey showed up and did this because I legit didn't see it coming. You idiot! You haven't learned a thing! In this world, it's kill or be killed. Well, I've killed a lot of people getting here. And game crash. One day, they all disappear without a trace. Alright. Continue on. Can I go past the save point? No? Okay. Alright. We're at the end. Save or return. Nope. File is erased. And boom. Hello, Flowey. Howdy. It's me, Flowey. Flowey the flower. I owe you a huge thanks. You really did number a little fool. Without you, I never could have gotten past him. But now, with your help, he's dead. And I've got this. I've got the human souls. Boy, I've been empty for so long. It feels great to have a soul inside me again. Hmm, I can feel them wriggling. Aw, you're feeling left out, aren't you? Well, that's just perfect. After all, I only have six souls. I still need one more before I become God. And then, with my newfound powers, monsters, humans, everyone, I'll show them all the real meaning of this world. Oh, I forget about escaping to your old save file. It's gone forever. But don't worry. Your old friend Flowey has worked out a replacement for you. I'll save over your own death. So you can watch me tear you to bloody pieces. Over and over and over. What? Do you really think you can stop me? <laughs> you really are an idiot. Not sure how I'm gonna do the... The coin flip on him. See, inevitably, I'm going to get one or the other if I keep flipping it every time I get I get a mercy. So inevitably, he's just going to die in the end. Unless he's got really good odds against him. Or odds going for him. So I'm just going to flip it once, and then I'll choose the, the option based on that. Alright, Flowey, come on. All right, come at me, bro. Ow. Ouch. Ah, dang it. Those flamethrowers keep getting me. Okay. 
I've seen some people. I've seen some people have been able to do no hit run throughs of this, and I don't know how they do it. Okay. Okay. Knives. Ow. Call for help. There we go. Thank you for the bandages. Oh, oh dear. Ouch. Here come the blockbusters. Ow. You ever want to see a plant drop a nuke on somebody? There it is. Okay. Whoa. Ow. Ow. All right, come on. Whoa. Ah, dang it. I'm gonna die at least once. Oh. I expected him to hit me before he did this again. Oh. Ballerina shoes. Ow. Ow. Not quite a full health, but good enough. Gotta dodge these big bouncing mouths. Okay. Come on, just three more, and then we got this. Oh yeah. Last time I said those were tapes, because I thought they were VHSs, but it's actually a notebook. The only thing I noticed is that a lot of the weapons you find, like, are the same weapons used by Flowey Souls, like the human souls Flowey has. So I think so I'm I am like 100 percent certain that the weapons you find were the weapons of the fallen humans. So, if Undertale ever gets a... Oh. Ever gets a sequel or a prequel? Prequel more likely. Uh, they need to have a story about the other six humans that were down here before Frisk fell... Before Frisk fell in. Or before... Like, after Kara, before Frisk. We need to see what their lives were like. And how they died. Oh yeah, this part. Ow. Ow. Come on. There we go. Not sure if those are eggs or donuts or whatever, but I'll take them. Still not quite full health, but almost there. Ouch. I still have no idea how I'm supposed to dodge all this. Ow. Alright, last soul. Come on, I can do this. Okay, there we go. Alright, so the souls are rebelling against Flowey, and now I finally get to lay the smackdown on him.
thank you for all the hope and the for the clovers and the omelets. Flyers defense dropped to zero. Hack away and hack away. Man, his attacks are moving a lot more slowly now. Why is, it why is it taking so long to kill him? It didn't take this long last time. Come on. Come on, Flowey, die already. I, I'm just mashing the button over and over again. Almost got him. I wonder whose face that is in the TV. It looks like something off the Game Boy camera. One more. KO! Whew. That certainly took long enough. No! No! This can't be happening! You! You! Idiot. <laughs> you idiot! Yeah, Super Troll. Uh, dodge, dodge, please. Ow! Oh, nope. Ow. 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 Let me move, please, let me move! No? Okay. Okay. Huh. <sighs> Did you really think you could defeat me? I am the god of this world, and you? You're hopeless. Hopeless and alone. Golly, that's right. Your worthless friends can't save you now. Call for help, I dare you. Cry into the darkness. Mommy, Daddy, somebody help. See what good it does you. Call for help, but nobody can. Boy, what a shame. Nobody else is going to get to watch you die. <laughs> eh, what? How do you... Uh, well, I I'll just, uh... Nope. Huh. That moment when your safe states are corrupted. What? Where are my powers? And the human souls are turning on you. The souls? What are they doing? No! No! You can't do that! You're supposed to obey me! Stop! Stop it! Stop! <sighs> Hello, Flowey. And now, pop up the DS capture screen. Coin flip to decide your fate! After all that, after all the people I killed but didn't want to, one of the people he's, that the coin spares is Flowey? No! I, no! 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 Why? Let's find out what happened if I kept going. Like, how long would it have taken? Two. Three. It would have taken four coin flips to get a fight on him. Okay. Well... Following what the coin said. Here we go. Mercy. What are you doing? Do you really think I've learned anything from this? No. Okay, two. Spare me won't change anything. Killing me is the only way to end this. I want to, believe me. That's three. If you let me live, I'll come back. And now I would kill him if I was doing it the original way I was I was I was thinking about doing it. I'll kill you. I'll kill everyone. I'll kill everyone you love! Question 
question mark. Why? Why are you being so nice to me? I can't understand. I can't understand. I just can't understand. And he runs away. Ugh. I can't believe that. Like, he is the one, like, one of the few bosses that the game actually, or that the coin actually made me spare. When he is the only one I legitimately wanted to kill. <sighs> How's that? Like, that that's, that's life for you, I suppose. Hard to tell by Toby Fox. <sighs> so now, now we're just gonna sit through the credits and then watch, uh, have Fly talk to us. And that pretty much concludes, concludes the randomized neutral run. Mushroom uh, Ragle. Or Raggle, however you pronounce that. <sighs> ring a ding ding. Hey, Sans, we're gonna get a different phone call this time. Hey, yeah. Is anyone there? Well, I'll just leave you a message. So, it's been a while since you left. Things have really gotten have gotten really strange. Overnight, a bunch of people have mysteriously disappeared. As well as the human souls. People were heartbroken. Everyone they looked up to, everything they were relying on, in one night disappeared. Everyone clamored to elect a new ruler as fast as possible. So, uh, by process of elimination, Papyrus became the ruler? Why doesn't he talk to you about this? Hello, my- Hello, human! This is Rage. Asgore, Alphys, Metaton, and Undyne went away. Alphys went into hiding after I killed, uh, Metaton. Since is they're on vacation. I hope they're having fun. Oh yeah, I'm the ruler of the underground now, which is a step above Captain of the Royal Guard. Maybe thing is improving a lot here. Productivity is up, because I tell everyone to keep working. And no one goes hungry, because I cook everyone's spaghetti. Oh, you poison everybody! Meanwhile, my brother handles the paperwork. Strangely, he seems to be working hard. This sounds messed up, but... I'm proud of him? Oh no! As for our human policy, we decided, um, Sans, what was it? You can't judge humans to be all good or all bad. Right, so it's case by case. If they're evil, we give them puzzles. If they're good, we also give them puzzles. That seems to be the best way. Is Sans gone? You know, don't tell my brother, but despite the improvements we've made, sometimes this job is kind of hard. Since the king went away, lots of people just want to give up. Sometimes, even my best encouragement doesn't work. And, and, I miss Undyne, too. She never answers my phone calls. She must be having a lot of fun on vacation. I just wish she sent a postcard. But hey, I, I won't give up. I can't give up. I have to make everyone, I have to make everyone give up giving up. We'll get out of here slowly. Then we can all hang out again. Yeah. Click. Hey, since you defeated me, I've been thinking, is killing things really necessary? I... I honestly don't know anymore. I have a request for you. Prove to me... Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Get here from the beginning, without killing a single thing. And I won't kill the king. You liar! Then you'll have your so-called happy ending. So, what will it be? Will you prove yourself, or will I get to watch you suffer? Either way, I'm interested. <laughs> okay, just gonna go ahead and... <sighs> well... It's like I said at the end of the pacifist run. I feel like a real jerk after this. I killed, I killed some of my favorite characters. My number one favorite, Papyrus, lived. You can't kill Napstablook, which is good. So, he survived, uh, Metaton died, wait, I feel bad, I feel bad for this, and I still have genocide mode to do, I still have to kill everybody in the entire freaking underground. <sighs> well, I suppose not, not much to say, like, Papyrus does sound like he'd be a good ruler, he does, but he... He's gonna poison everybody by feeding him spaghetti, but legit, that actually... 
that ending and watching Alf, watching Undying slowly fall apart like that, that was, that was getting to me. Well, there it is. Like, I, I don't like it. I don't like what I did. But there is the randomized neutral run. I killed some, I killed most of the boss monsters and only a handful survived. So... Uh, I'm not going to go back and do any extras on this one, just because there are so many different variables for the different uh, neutral endings you can get. But uh, the next time I play Undertale, I'm most likely going to start my Genocide run. So, this has been Blake Cross CXE, part of Flashy Blaze Productions. Thank you so much for watching, and tune in next time. Peace out.